For any Xbox or PlayStation codes or cheap games on any platform, use the referral link in the description. It'll take you to G2A.com. Use the promo code CHEZ over there and you'll get yourself 3% cash back. For all No Identity merchandise, hats, hoodies and t-shirts, follow the link in the description down below to the No Identity Fan Fiber website. Hey guys, welcome to episode number 14 of the Arsenal career mode here on FIFA 17. We are very near the transfer window now. Today we'll play Everton and Manchester City. And in the next episode, we will face West Brom and Palace and we'll be into the window. There is another game to be scheduled in January, which will be on this Saturday, presumably, uh, in the FA Cup. So uh, we will have an extra game in January to play than what is already currently scheduled. But for now, we're going to concentrate on Everton and City. The league is looking very healthy in our favour. We're actually, well, I didn't realise we're actually that far uh, ahead, actually. We're nine points clear at the top of the table, having a phenomenal season so far. Oh, we are on Legendary, of course. Uh, we are contemplating what to do in the window and uh, I'll probably rotate a little bit for this game against Everton to ensure that everybody's fully fit for the game against City. We have about 23 million to spend currently but we are we are contemplating selling uh, Mesut Ertzel and we are still unsure as to what to do with Alexis Sanchez. I think in the last episode I altered uh, Sanchez's instructions, didn't I? I haven't. What I want to do is tell him to cut inside. There we go. I wanted to do that in the last episode, and clearly I forgot. But we've done that now. We'll try and get a little bit more out of Alexis, and if I can, then he'll stay. But at the minute, he's not offering enough in this first team. He's not going to play against Everton, though. He'll play against Manchester City. Drop the video a like if you enjoy. Subscribe to the channel, too, to make sure you don't miss out on more. Follow the link in the description as well to Twitch, so you can watch me stream these live. So you can have a live interaction with me, especially when we get into the transfer window, which will be in a couple of days' time. But we will uh, we'll play Everton away first. Danny Welbeck there playing for Everton, as you can see. So they're clearly utilising uh, him after we sold him to them. But for now, I'm going to just rearrange my team and jump in. I want to see what starting lineup they're putting out. Stegler, Coleman, Murray, Michael Keane starts. As does Wayne Rooney up top. No, Rooney's at Cam. They're playing Rooney at Cam and Danny Welbeck up top. Uh, they have Sandro on the bench and Davy Clarsen on the bench. So. New signings in the starting lineup and on the bench for Everton. Rooney starting behind Danny Welbeck is how they'll start up top. We'll see if they can actually do any damage against me. Having a good season, Everton. They're in fifth or fourth, one of the two. I think it was fifth. So they uh, clearly can do a job, but will they be the first team to inflict an away defeat on us? We will find out. Rambo, Wilshire, Dolberg. Oh, good touch and turn. We'll get it out wide, and it's perfectly weighted for Valde. It's out, and I'll pull it back, looking for Dolberg. Oh, he's tried to poke it. He still might drop free. It's gone in. I think that's an own goal. I'm not sure how that's ended up in the back of the net or who the goal will go down to. He tried to poke it there, and it's well blocked, and I don't know who got the final touch. I think Dolberg. Let's have a quick look. Oh, yeah, Michael Keane has kicked that against Dolberg's foot, and it's gone in. So that will go down as Kasper Dolberg's goal. It will. After five minutes, we lead. Oh, shit. We use the left back first. Drive inside. There we go. That's wrong footed Seamus Coleman. So we can then slot through Balde. And, well, let's try the same tactic again, shall we? Drill it back. Kalashinats caught penalty. We're all over Everton. All over Everton right now. Is that going to be a yellow card? or No, he's going to get away with it, Lennon. Well, at least with regards to card. He's just... I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure about that. Let's give it to Kasper Dolberg. Oh, my man. We weren't able to get you a hat-trick against Monaco, but we could get you a second here, but we can't. Stekelberg with a remarkable save. No Jordan Pickford, actually, which is interesting. I would have thought they'd have started him, but at full stretch, that wasn't a bad penalty. That was just genuinely a very, very good save. Up we go. It's going to drop, but drop straight to Leighton Baines. Could be oh, I thought about chopping him there. I'm glad I didn't. Welbs. Oh, that's a dangerous ball. That was moving all over the place. Sergio Roberto can only concede a corner. Rooney to deliver it. Eventually. Thank you, Wayne. Oh, that's a poor delivery, but Welbeck does chest it down. Into Seamus Coleman. Backs in well. And the shot. Oh, wow. Okay. Seamus Coleman makes it 1-1. That was a good finish. I'll give him that. That was a very good finish. I thought it was a very bad call. It just that turn there just made me end up having to go around him rather than through him because I didn't want to give away a penalty. And he's just, with no back lift, swung and put that into the top corner. Check at full stretch, nowhere near it. Right then, 
Well, we've missed a penalty and conceded, so it's 1-1. It could have been 2-0, but it's not. Moving forward with some danger. Shots on here. Wow. I just... My jaw dropped because I envisaged that flying tops with a first-time hit from Rooney. How far away was it? Great technique, bending towards that top corner. Oh, shit. He's come short there, Mesut. Drop the shoulder. We've done one. We've done two. Dolberg. Ramsey. Oh, we've got runners. One of which... Oh, it's Balde Keita. Who will give us a 2-1 lead? That's a nice finish. Pleased with that. Even though I'm probably going to sell him on in the January transfer window. That is a good finish. Ramsey, I just had to wait. I was trying to wait for Sergio Roberto, but he didn't arrive in time. And that's a nice finesse, actually. Right into the top corner. We lead. This is a nice passing move, but will it end in a goal-scoring opportunity? I'm not sure. He's going to go for the 1-2, Dolberg. And I'll poke that ahead of Lamar. Good shot, well saved. Pushing for a third. Not able to get it yet. Win that header, please. Oh, bloody hell. Didn't he just? Oh, giving it away, though. That'll do for now. All right, Ozil to take the corner. It's a good one. Up we go. Ramsey. Oh, did he save that? No, he missed it. Wow, great opportunity. Right, corners come in. Morales is on. Oh, they've taken Rooney off now. That was Rooney's last action of the game. Oh, Klaassen. Literally, immediately on the field, immediately has a chance. Heading that towards the near post. Well saved by Tech. Can we get this away? Ozil's touch is poor. Funes Mori comes away with it. I've dived in and I've missed it. Funes Mori, Tech with a save again. Arsenal under pressure here. Morales again to deliver. This time goes for a loopy one, and that will be Petr Cech's. Well, keepers up. Stecklenberg is up for the corner in the last minute. They played it short, and I was going to say that might be a mistake, but I couldn't get there. He'll keep this in, David Klaassen, or will he let it spin out for a corner? Well, I think he tried to keep it in, but in the end it spins out for a corner. Stecklenberg still up for it. Morales crosses. Head that away. There we go. Someone run after it. Oh, never mind. No one's going to get there, but the referee might blow his final whistle as soon as Idrissa gets to it. And he hasn't. Yes, he has. A 2-1 win at Goodison Park. Our unbeaten away record in the league continues. Kasper Dahlberg's goal-scoring run continues. And it's time to head now to Manchester City, who are drawing currently 1-1 with Watford. Ten points clear at the top. Could go even further. Who's going to be in their starting lineup? Oh, I skipped it. I skipped it accidentally, so I did. Who's in their starting lineup then? Sané, Aguero, Sterling, Gundogan, Fernandinho, Fernando, Walker, Otamendi, Company, Danilo, Bravo. Okay. Familiar enough looking City side. Surprised they're playing Danilo over Mendy, but maybe he's injured. Casemiro, Lamar. See the run. Bayerine. Into Casemiro. Cross to Asensio on his left foot. This has to be 1 0. What a save by Bravo. I'm not going to win that header, so I'm not even going to try. Nacho Monreal. How has Bravo stopped that? Lamar's actually left foot, so I'll try and cut back on that left. And, oh, I won't take that first time. Company does well again. How has, Com how has Bravo saved that? Son of a bitch. I was certain that was going to be 1 0 with Asensio in that position. Is it? Oh, what Lacazette stood all the way back there. Oh, nice footwork from Casemiro and Asensio. This time, oh, deflected, and Claudio Bravo still keeps it out. Bravo's on fire. Early cross. Lacazette. This time. No, off the post. And again. Oh, wide. I can't score against Man City. I'm doing everything I possibly can, but I can't score against Manchester City. He just won't go in. Essentially with a tackle. Casemiro. Lamar. Get that through there to check out. Help it out wide to Alexis. Uh, square it. Oh, oh, piss. oh, I've got a corner. It's all right. Essentially to whip in the set piece towards the near post. And up we go. And Lacazette somehow won that header. But I was in control of Koscielny. Saved by Bravo again. That seems to be the theme in this game so far. He's on his bike. He's in behind. Down low is quick though. Get it back to Asensio. Drop the shoulder. Pull it back to Casemiro. I want to go all the way across to Alexis. Drop the shoulder. Get in. Square it across. Surely at last we lead. Alexandre Lacazette with the assist from Alexis. It took a trampy pullback to be able to finally make the way past Claudio Bravo. And he's still got something on it and nearly kept it out. Well, not nearly kept it out, but 
got something on it at the very least, trying to keep it out. But four minutes before half time, we are 1 0 in front. Alexis played in. You see Lamar on the far side. Oh, Alexis, that is a beautiful ball. And I'll turn inside and Lamar. And Alexis. And Lacazette. Oh, that was a bit of a carbon copy. Alexis pulls it back to Lacazette. Lacazette strokes it home. Two goals in three minutes. And we find ourselves 2 0 up. Corner for City, Leroy Sané again to take it. Gundwan off. Who have they brought on? David Silva or Bernardo Silva. Could be either, actually, couldn't it? Not sure. Fernando's off for Kevin De Bruyne. And here's Vincent Company. Not sure. Still not sure if it's Bernardo Silva or David Silva that's come on. Winding up for the cross, deflected. That'll be another corner. I'm trying to keep an eye on the pitch, but I, I can't see. Sané to take the corner. I can't see Bernardo or... Um, David, to be honest. Comes clear by check. Bayerine racing back. Can't get there. Otamendi. Fernandinho has been known to occasionally ping one in from distance. This is pressure from City. We were able to withstand the similar amount of pressure from Everton in the last game. Can we do it here again? Otamendi, good tackle by Casemiro. Try and get this away. I wasn't meant for Asensio, but it's gone to him anyway. We'll poke that for Lacazette. Nicely into Casemiro. Oh, who's faster, Casemiro or Otamendi? There's probably not much in it. Otamendi's stronger at that particular moment in time. Is it? Lovely ball through to Asensio. He's in here. And I will use the run of Alexis, who will give us a third. Two assists and a goal for Alexis Sanchez. Clearly, the change in tactics with regards to his player instructions has worked. Think... On this performance, Alexis Sanchez will be staying at the football club. He's not going anywhere in January. Ozil, on the other hand, definitely going to leave. Oh, if that was his intention, that was a great pass. Sané could save Czech. They've had chances, City. They've had plenty of chances. Just Czech's been too good for them. All their finishing just hasn't been good enough. Head that away. Three minutes added on for the three goals that we've scored. Although two came in the first half, but still. Adarabi Oyo. Moving into Sané and away no, Kyle Walker with a header wide so convincing victory here he really for those Arsenal fans that are out there in fact, you know what, let's just kick the ball towards those Arsenal fans because why the hell not Essentially, will chase after it and flick that on maybe but it's going to drop to Sterling but the final whistle won't be too far away now and in fact, there it is a 3-0 win away from home at the Etihad that was very convincing I didn't think it was going to go that well initially when Claudio Bravo was making save after save after save after save. But, eventually, through sheer persistence, we were able to get the goals we wanted and the victory. What does the league table look like? We should have a massive lead, and indeed we do have a massive lead at the top of the table. Have a quick train and then I'll show you the league table. This is a similar sort of season to the year we had at Napoli in the uh, final year of that series. Obviously, this is the first season of this one. But at present, we are 13 points clear at the top of the league, having won 14 of our opening 17. Chelsea, Watford, Spurs, all there on 31 and 30, respectively. United in 6th, Man City in 8th, Liverpool in 11th. It's not necessarily us being amazing, but everyone else is underperforming. Chelsea have lost 4 of their opening 17. Spurs have drawn 6 of their opening 16. Man United have lost 5 already. City have lost five already. Liverpool have lost eight. West Ham in the relegation zone. Brighton's still down there, only on eight points, still in single digits. But that's going to bring this episode to a close. Thank you very much for watching, everyone on YouTube. Hit the like button if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel to make sure you don't miss out on more. I'm going to go and record another episode now on stream as well, so I'll see everybody in chat in a moment. But here on YouTube, the next episode of this will be on Thursday, but check the channel page for anything you may have missed, whether it be this series or the uh, Fatal series, which started at the weekend, or of course the Oviedo series, which is still coming to you daily right now. But for now, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.